asked the guys, um, you guys have had some pretty bright spots last year. How are you going to try and carry some of that momentum over into this year? We did. We um, last year we had some individual performances. Josh Gibbons had a you know great year last year. Um, a couple other kids had some good seasons. Um, but as a team, we you know we need to play better. Team defense needs to improve. Um, just everybody in general has to get more into a team concept, and we got to play together. Yeah, you can put up 45 points, but if you give up 50, and you know, that's exactly what happened. We were able to score last year, but we couldn't uh, couldn't stop anybody on defense. And we got to get better defensively. We got to create turnovers. Um, you know, and just that team concept has to improve. Have you seen any, anything in the off season that gives you some confidence that you guys are going to be able to, to win some games this year? This we have a good senior group this this year. With uh, we'll have six or seven kids, uh, seniors that have been coming. That doesn't seem like a lot to most programs, but for us, that that's a big amount. And we've had uh, those kids showing up, you know, um, all summer. So for them to be there and pushing the younger kids, it's it's been good to see. So the senior leadership is what I'm most happy with. I asked the guys too about playing the underdog role, and, and they like to play that role, but they said it's getting old. So what do you think you guys need to do to kind of get over that hump? We just need to play better. I mean, the, the underdog role is great, and, but we've got to win some games. I mean, that's what it comes down to. Um, and hopefully with this group, they have a little bit of confidence. You know, they've, they've been there. They've been in games last year. Um, and then the year before, they, they these kids, the, the seniors, have played for three years, so four years, most of them. Um, so and we'll have a couple younger kids that will need to chip in and help out as well. I, I keep saying it's it's like too early to talk about, but it's not really. It's only three weeks away. Have you looked at that week one game yet? And you know, oh, yeah. what are your we, thoughts on that? Yeah, I mean, Marion Center's a team that you know they beat us last year. Um, they were very competitive all all year last year, so we knew that was going to be a tough game. Um, but we've been looking at you know film. There's a new coach though. Um, you know, and he's going to bring his own style, you know, up. he's going to put his, you know, mark on the program. So we're just going to, we'll, we'll have the, the scrimmage and, you know, we'll go from there. But we're, we're just working with ourselves right now, trying to make ourselves better players. Um, our team concept, we're trying to improve that right now. Um, anything has, that's been surprising for you in the off season, or anything that you've seen from the kids that you know you're looking forward to seeing more of in camp? Um, we, I mean, we're, like I said, we're not going. Our numbers aren't going to be huge. We'll be right around 21, 22 kids probably dressing up. But out of those 21 kids, we've had the coaches have had to sit and we've had to look and see who's going to play here, who's going to play there. We haven't done that in the past. Before it was just plug a kid in here because we have that position open. Now we have enough kids that we, we can actually have those conversations that most programs have. So that that's good to do as, as a coaching staff. So um, the numbers, the turnout has been great. You know, 21 kids in the summer, you know, you're getting pretty much 95% of your team showing up in the summer, which is great. So I've been very happy with that this summer. We've got a couple new kids coming out, um, you know, that we're, we're going to lean on a little bit. So, um, but it's just it's been a good summer, and the kids have been coming. So happy with that. Any particular goals or expectations you're going to put on them, or are you kind of just going to say, hey, let's go and try and win some games? Well, defensively, I mean, that's where we got to we got to create some turnovers. We got to play better defense. Um, offensively, we got to run the ball a little better and protect Josh a little bit. Josh was our work workhorse last year, um, but we have four or five four running backs that you know this year that we're all going to try. We'll all contribute. Um, you know, we'll try to get everybody involved a little more to take a little bit of weight off Josh's shoulders. All right, Chris, sounds good. Thank you. Hey.